Uh, Rangers star was on Saturday when they beat First Division West Bromwich Albion by the only goal, and that was their giant defender, Bob Hazel, who had the unenviable task of looking after their star striker, Cyril Regis. But Bob also found time to take part in Rangers' victory goal. Nice ball back to Fennec. Bob Hazel still well forward, well played. And Allen. And Fennec. And now Micklewhite. And Hazel. And Ali Robertson. Oh, and it's gone in. Brian Allen didn't know much about it, but he scored. White is having an increasing influence on the match on the Rangers' right. Owen. Regis! And for what he beat Hazel, but his header went wide. But there haven't been many times this afternoon, if any others, when Hazel has come off second best for Regis. And Bob Hazel was brilliant for Rangers today. One of their outstanding players. He subdued Regis. And Allen got the ricochet off Robertson's clearance to give Rangers a place in the FA Cup final for the first time in their history. That must have been a marvellous moment. What about uh, Cyril Regis, who you're marking? Now, you live in the Midlands still, and I gather he's a neighbour of yours. Did you speak to him after the game? Well, I tried, but there wasn't really much I could say to him, you know. Mm -hmm. And had you met him before the game, did you speak to him up in the Midlands ever? No, I kept well away. Did you? And if I could ask you, I mean, as, as we saw, he only beat you once during the whole game. How do you think you beat him on Saturday afternoon? Because he's a very fast player. Well, um, we decided that his strength was actually picking the ball up and running at, running at defenders. So, therefore, I decided to get as close to him as possible as to stop him from actually getting the ball and running at us, and it worked. It did work. <laughs> now, the plastic pitch this season seems to have helped you at Rangers in particular. Is that so? Looking at you play on it. Well, I've, I've adapted to it quite well. And um, not that it's helped me personally. I mean, it's there for everybody, but it's, it's just who adapts to it. And how has it particularly helped your game? Well, I don't really think it's... It's not really done anything for my game, personally, but as I say, it's just that I've adapted to it quite well, and mm. there are just certain things that you you do, and... Because you meet the ball, um, and what I might ask, you've been in and out of the team, haven't you? Consistency sometimes hasn't been the best part of your game. Uh, how have you felt? Have you felt it's been a battle to get into the team? And then last week, you read they've, they've brought Steve Wicks. Yeah, well, it had been a battle before, and now it's even more of a battle. And it means that if, I, if I'm going to stay in the team, I've got to keep on battling. And how did it affect you when they brought Wicks? Didn't really think about it. And a uh, quick word about Spurs. Will you win? We'll win. Sue. Well, this week, 